And we see this every single day. So most people who have it don't have symptoms. That's what they call it, the silent killer. High blood pressure. So now we have just very simple. People say I go to Walmart and I, or Publix, I get my, put my hand and I get a blood pressure. Well, you know, I believe that everyone should, you know, after age of 65 should have a, blood pressure, a little investment, like you invest in stocks and all that, invest in your health and, and, and buy one of those blood pressure machines at home. The one over the arm, not the, the, not the, the uh, wrist, because this, the wrist one is, is, uh, is false. It doesn't give you accurate uh, numbers. Most people find it about when they visit a doctor. I don't want to see the doctor. I will wait till, you know, if they ain't broke, don't fix it. You know, all this stuff, that's something from the past. The emphasis now is on prevention. Now, we tell you in Brooksville Cardiology, if there's a problem, we'll fix it. If there's no problem, we'll make sure it stays that way. And um, Dr. Terzini, how are you? He's a great doctor here in Hernando County. Thank you for coming out. So some people who have high blood pressure, they said will help their health because they have a problems, like I said, the three organs, the head, the brain, stroke, the heart, heart attack, and failure, and then the kidney failure, people going on to the dialysis. So it's very important to check it and control it. And it is controllable. We have so many choices and flavors of medications that control the blood pressure and prevent that. So let's go on uh, shopping. You know, I don't know if you like Walmart or Publix or whatever you're shopping. Look, look at what you eat. Look at what you put inside the system. Fast food, olives. I mean, the olives that has high salt. I think the olives without high salt is good. Potato chips, pretzels, canned soups. You'll see like loaded of salt. Uh, crackers, um, you have biscuits, ham, pancakes, sausage, the list goes on. Hot dogs, sardines, you know, and, then, and it's very predictable. They say we went out and had this food and boom. I couldn't breathe, blood pressure was off the roof, and I ended up going to the hospital. It's very predictable. So, and it's preventable too. Keeping it down with lifestyle changes, you know, lose weight, reduce salt, eat as at least five servings of, of fruits and vegetables, and physical activity, whatever it is that you can do that you enjoy, walking, dancing, swimming, um, you know, uh, biking, uh, you know, uh, getting on, a, on a, you know, one of the stationary bikes at home if the weather is bad. Today, actually, we had the first, you know, sunny day in so long. <laughs> you know, I couldn't believe this is Florida weather, you know. I think the, uh, the global warming is out this year, right? <laughs> so lower your cholesterol level and maintain a good blood pressure. And please do quit smoking and, and excessive drinking, and we'll talk about that. So sometimes, you know, you have to custom tailor, if you would, all the medication to fit this person, that person, and not all one size fits all. So we, we discuss the potential you know, side effects of the medication and we'll try to work it out to minimize it. Only God is perfect, remember that. And so if one doesn't work, you try the other, but don't give up. We don't give up in Brooksville Cardiology, on anyone. And we have uh, a lot of uh, success examples, we have Miracle Patients on the website. You just click on Miracle Patients on, uh, on brooksvillecardiology.com. And you could also uh, look into the impact of, of this you know, uh, medication on, on, on folks. So very, very important to realize that and work with the doctor. You know, we, we talk, we interact. So the bottom line is we want it to control. So increase urination, difficulty getting erection, it's very important. You know, in males it's a big uh, quality of, of life issue, dizziness, tiredness, muscle cramps, cough, and spelling, uh, swelling of ankles. Now if somebody goes, I went to the doctor, I want to give, went to the pharmacist trying to, to fill out prescription. God, everything you give me have all these side effects. You're, you're trying to kill me or something. You know, no. <laughs> but, you know, there is no medication that's, that's free of, of side effects and we try to, like I said, find the right medication. And 99.9% .9 we were able to do that. There are some tough cases, but you still you know, go around the list till you find the one that clicks. And sometimes we compromise. So it won't be 100% you know, side effect free, but we still can live with it and still have a productive life without strokes or going to the hospital with side effects. Because that's the bottom line, folks. If you know your blood pressure, what's the risk of many health problems? Most people can tell if they have high blood pressure. How could you do that? Anybody can tell me? How do you know you have high blood pressure all of a sudden? Headache, 
Some people get nosebleed because it's like a faucet. You know, I start to have nosebleed because the pressure increases in, inside the brain and that, otherwise they blow up a vessel inside the, inside the, the brain. So from anybody, the medication lifestyle is very important like we discussed earlier about the alcohol, smoking and, 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 and activities. At the end, you're responsible for your own health. And that's going to be the wave of the future. If somebody does all wrong stuff, you know, maybe you will not be able to get insurance, you know, for, for health and so on. And, uh, and unfortunately, it can be, can be correlated with the credit and, and, and it's, you know, somebody's responsible, you cannot take care of themselves and their health, they probably cannot do the same thing in other areas. And, and that's a big, big thing. So most, the most important is to, to maintain a healthy lifestyle. Everybody's stressed out. So how to do that? You come to Brooksville Cardiology because uh, we have, you know, you know, it seems like somebody's ongoing parties, all laughing and joking and, and try to take that stress away. It's very, very important so you can, you know, continue on to function in life. So we have all kinds of uh, literature. And like I said, the Brooksville Cardiology um, is available on a 24-7 basis. And um, let me ask you, uh, how many of you shop over at, uh, at the uh, coastal um, um, uh, mall here on uh, 50, Cortez Boulevard? Ladies, anybody? Okay, all right. How about those? We have our, our, our beating heart on 50, right one block away from Oak Hill Hospital, which we thank so much for sponsoring that night uh, program. And uh, we're also going to have a, another satellite, and uh, if somebody goes in the shopping in Wiregrass Mall, just across from Wiregrass Mall, this is a satellite location for those who like to shop in Tampa. So, nutrition label. How do you look into this? You look into the calories, you know, on top. You look into what's in there. It will tell you if there is a cholesterol, how much. If somebody have high cholesterol, doc, what should I eat? Go and read the label. Zero, you know, zero cholesterol, or somebody tell you have, you know, very high cholesterol stuff, you stay away from it. It will tell you total fat. It will tell you sodium. This is 300 milligrams. Sometimes people can have, you know, two grams per serving. You know that somebody, you know, in the canned soup, you know, they know once they have it and, and they have this soup, they will follow, you know, a couple of days like that, they will end up having swallowing feet, short of breath, and, and, and no wonder their blood pressure will be off the roof. So saturated fat, the, this is bad. Remember, go to fast food places, and again, it's a change of culture. What you put in is what, you're, you're, you, know, what you're, you will be eventually uh, be. If you put good gas, you get good performance, and vice versa. So unsaturated you know, uh, fat is the one to go. You don't want the saturated fat. Sodium, you want to minimize. Carbs, you want to minimize. And the fiber, you want to increase because it will help you regulate the diet, you know, the, you know, going to the bathroom. It will help you to prevent, for instance, irritable bowel syndrome, uh, colitis, uh, diverticulitis, you know, all these things. Part of the therapy for in, in Crohn's and so on to increase your fiber in the diet. And you know, you know, you have, uh, you know, calorie count for those who on, have diabetics on a verge of diabetic of diabetes to, to to know and calculate how much calories. I got 200 in the morning. I got, you know, five, 500 at lunch. Maybe I should be okay in uh, in the, in the dinner. Or I went out and I have a thousand in the morning. Then then I'll have a light dinner and, and end up with with a total of 1,500 calories in that way. Now 